Hi, good morning. Uh, my name is Mohammed Abdelbar. I'm a neurosurgeon at the Duke University Hospital. Um, I do uh, spine surgery, mostly minimally invasive spine surgery. I've uh, been here for about five years. So my background is actually in biomedical engineering, so I really uh, enjoy uh, medical devices and so on. And so uh, I did my undergrad at the University of Toronto in uh, electrical engineering and my master's in biomedical engineering. Uh, and then I was able to do some clinical kind of studies and I was really focused on kind of both doing clinical and um, and, and research, so I actually did an MD-PhD in neuroscience. The greatest thing about being a neurosurgeon is that you really get to help people at their most vulnerable um, and help them just kind of get back to the lives that they once were enjoying. Um, and then we also get to use really cool types of instrumentation and medical devices and so on. It's a very, very busy day. I start my day most uh, days at 4 a.m. I wake up at 4 a.m. to do my uh, catch up on my research and administrative duties. Um, we have both a basic science lab, a translational lab, and a clinical science lab. Uh, and so that takes a lot of time and effort. So usually start off at waking up very early, trying to get as much research and academics done and then coming in to the hospital, usually around 6 a.m. I think you have a video of me being the first one in the parking lot this morning. <laughs> um, and then, depending on the day, it's either operating room or clinic, uh, and then interspersed with that a lot of other uh, academic and administrative duties. Um, it's a long road. Um, it took me 21 years until I was kind of uh, on my own doing surgery uh, from undergrad and graduate school and medical school and residency and fellowship. Uh, but it's a rewarding reward, uh, road, both on the way and when you quote unquote reach your destination. I tell everybody that I probably work harder now than I work even as a resident, but uh, you know, it's rewarding. You get to help people and uh, you know, we're making new things and changes in surgery and helping patients get better faster.